known as Sir Killington at Color Struck. And right now you're looking at the a, uh, an AME church, Emmanuel AME in South Carolina. Um, this church is the oldest AME church. It was erected in 1818. And this is the place where that coward took those people lives um, that day, that coward. Um, I came here, I don't know why I was, I was in South Carolina uh, visiting a friend and I felt as though I'm near Charleston. I might as well come here and see the place because this is one of those things that like changed my perspective on race relations in this country. Even though I, I was already a little bit radical, I'm way more radical than I am now because of this situation. And I'm just, just, look, just looking at this church makes me think. It makes me think about like how, I, how like this whole thing was like a cover up. Now I'm not some conspiracy theorist, but this, again, this church is the oldest AME church in the South. It was erected in 1818. Uh, the pastor, if, I, if, if I'm correct, was, uh, was a senator, was a politician at the time when they were gunned down by that coward. So like, I, like they tried, the, the media tried to make this dude, the media tried to make that, that kid a, just that a kid and like nothing else. And like, saying that he wasn't um yeah i saw i saw is that it that's it for them that's for the people oh and then oh man there it is the youngest 26 the oldest 87 coward bro i swear to god that man's a coward yeah man that kid wasn't no lone wolf he wasn't no lone wolf they and they tried to, they tried their hardest to, to to push that that narrative man he wasn't no lone wolf this ain't no lone this ain't no lone wolf act you don't come to the oldest the oldest ame church in the south and just randomly pick it and just randomly kill uh, intending to kill those people like that you know what i'm saying yeah, seventeen. There ain't no seventeen-year-olds doing that. Somebody sent him here. Anyway, I felt as though. Uh, anyway, I felt as though that I needed to come here, and they these people are not forgotten, um, even by people who are not from here and people who care about black people. These people are not forgotten. Um, I don't. I want these souls to know that they're not forgotten and that I do not forgive him. I don't care who forgave him. I don't forgive him. He wasn't no lone wolf. He wasn't no little kid. He knew what he was doing. So anyway, I, I, I just felt the need to come up here um, and see this beautiful church and see all the beautiful history. There's a lot of history attached to this church. Um, all right, guys. Uh, see you later.